Welcome back to a new video. I feel like it has been a really big hot minute since I have done a vlog because I tried to film Greece when I was away. If some of you follow me on Instagram, you'd have seen that I was away with Chloe in Greece for a week, which was amazing. However, I basically just filmed like little bits and it wasn't really me talking or showing anything interesting because we basically took the time as like a mini retreat to like just work, catch up, chill, hang out, eat really well, swim. I just needed some switch off time. So although I did like film a little bit of like clips here and there, which if I think they're like worthy of this video, then I might include a few as like a little time lapse like now. But if they're not there, it's because I've decided that they're just not worth it. But um, it was the most amazing trip and I am back. I've been back for like three days and it's been just nice kind of like getting back in the rhythm of things. And I've had some really big jobs, which has been really, really cool. Um, but today is Sunday, I've scrubbed my tan off. I've washed my hair, I've had a hair mask in overnight. So my hair feels so much nicer now. I'm gonna let it dry naturally because it is literally 22 degrees and it's 9 a.m. And I just feel like I've come back to the dreamiest weather and it's just stunning. So today is actually like, well this week really is going to be one of those things where I vlog like here and there but I just feel like I haven't caught up with you guys in a while and I miss vlogging and I miss filming bits and bobs and taking you guys along and things like that so I thought it'd be nice to just start doing bits when I can and not actually like putting the pressure on myself if I don't film all the time because I feel like sometimes I'm like oh I want to film this and I didn't film it and then I just stop vlogging because I'm like well there's not enough footage but I feel like that's not the case. I've been watching loads of people on YouTube and they just pick up the camera when they can and I love sitting and watching that kind of thing. So I just thought I would do this for the memes and create little bits here and there of like my week and my summer and things like that. So today is Sunday and Jamie's sister's actually moving house for like the first time, like into her proper big boy house. <laughs> big boy house? Big house. <laughs> like they bought a house. God, I can't get my words out. But we're helping them move in, so I definitely won't be filming that, but we are heading to the beach this morning, me and Jay, to go for a swim. I went in yesterday and it is so refreshing and it just reminds me all the time just how much I am in love with Brighton and why I probably will never leave. <laughs> like, I literally love it here. Like, out of all the places in the world, here and, I mean, I love Australia, but Australia is too far from my family, so I don't think I'll ever be able to live there, but I do feel like Australia would be my home away from home if I could. But otherwise Brighton and like Cornwall are just like my favorite places like here in the UK and I love them. So yeah, I'm feeling very grateful that we've got the sea today. So we're gonna go ahead there and then yeah, go and get some flowers and bits for like moving in presents. And I feel like I wanna get some of like, my little tea bags and biscuits maybe or something like that, but I don't know. I don't know, we'll see. But um, yes, yeah, so it's a very chilled Sunday and then I'm actually babysitting Badger tonight and tomorrow, my dad's and sister's puppy, um, which should be fun. So it's actually quite a nice two days of like switching off because I worked yesterday. So I get Sunday, Monday off, which is quite nice, um, which I never give myself. So good stuff. All I've got to do is just edit a few things. Um, I'm just very conscious that Jay's just texted me like, I'm here, <laughs> just chatting to you guys. But anyway, I am gonna take you guys along to the beach and take you along today as much as I can. And yeah, I'm excited to be vlogging again and catching up with you guys. Coffee time, coffee time. How are you feeling about going in the sea today? Coffee time. Coffee time. <laughs> We're heading down, we got our coffees. We got an iced oat latte. Jay got an oat latte. We're wearing the Berkies. I've worn mine in, guys. I wore them in in Rome. They're stunning. I love them. And then Jay's got his socks on with his because that's the way he wears them. I'm really cool. <laughs> <laughs> We went for a dip. It was delicious. Absolutely loved it. And we just seat belt. Seat belt. Sorry. Um, just went to Sainsbury's, picked up the flowers for Jamie's sister, and we got her some mugs and some really nice like pucker tea bags of like all the different flavors. Also, got myself some food, but 
does anyone else just sometimes have a crave for baby bells? Like, I actually crave them. Like, it's really random, isn't it? Like, once a month, I'll go buy a whole pack and eat them all. You're like a dunker, so it's just kind of like cheese. <laughs> it's a cheese. No, head. but sometimes I don't like that kind of stuff. It's really weird. I go through waves. I haven't had a dunker in about four months. Yeah, but if it was in front of you, you'd be bang up for it. I would be up for you'd it. You'd be dunking all day. I would absolutely love it. Um, but yeah, we went to Sainsbury's, got some really beautiful flowers from Bloom and Wild back there. I don't know if you guys can see. Um, and packed the oh, bars in and things like that and got her a really nice card. I got Jamie to write in that because my handwriting compared to Jamie's is honestly... India, just... India never went to school. <laughs> I did, so. but I had one of those pens where you have... Because I hold my pen like this. like. Let me yeah, show you. So, we just so this is how I hold right. my pen. And then they used to put this little slip plastic silicone thing on to make me write like this. And I just still to this day don't like writing like that. Um, I think it's because where I broke my arm, it's more comfortable the other way. Um, but anyway, we're going to the house. So I probably won't film anything when we're there because obviously it's family stuff. Um, but excited and yeah, just going to be a very nice family weekend two days I guess and chilling out in the sunshine but it's just so beautiful I think me and Jay are going to go paddle boarding Tuesday evening potentially I was like let's take a pizza on the boards but Jay was like there's not a chance did you see me on that board <laughs> Jay just keeps falling in I'll see if I can leave a little clip on the screen of us when we took it out for the first time but they're such good paddle boards they literally took us what like 10 minutes to blow up less than that less than that and then to take down I was expecting at least 20 minutes but no again like not, not even 10 minutes so so no, good no. um really quick really really fun they're from the paddle and co as well which i'll leave links to in case any of you guys are looking for some really good decent paddle boards but um, i'm gonna eat some lunch really quickly before we arrive because otherwise i'm just eating and no one else is eating apart from me um so yeah anyway show you guys in a bit what we get up to but just loving the sunshine loving this heat wave so 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 much very happy you happy yeah <laughs> Good morning my lovelies, so it is now the day after the video you saw. <laughs> um, I fake tanned last night, so I am currently in the fake tan, need to wash it off. But um, I use the Isle of Paradise Dark Mousse and it's just such a nice, like, natural, well, not natural on me, but it kind of looks, I feel like, it could be my own if I did fake tan. <laughs> So it's one of my favourites. I've used it for nearly four years now and it's just the best of the best. And they actually brought out a new mitt, which I used last night. I'll show you this mitt. And it's so good. Like, it literally just glides on the tan and I feel like it's worked better for my tan. Like, I don't know. I just feel like it's gotten on nicer than it usually does. But um, it's currently 6.20 in the morning, which is why I'm whispering. But um, it is the heat wave week, so it is currently like 22 degrees, which is just like mad. But the sky today is quite overcast, which I'm kind of glad about because I am outdoor shooting most of the day in Brighton from like one, I think, and I just get so hot. <laughs> so I'll just show you the view. Like, this is just a really, really peaceful day. It feels very flat. <laughs> So yeah, I am up bright and early. I am heading to boxing today. I wanted to get back into like some kind of routine and I am just loving Rock's life like so much. It's basically in, I guess like Brunswick, Palmyra area. And um, I'm just gonna sit on my chair. <laughs> and it's just such a nice community. Everyone is so, so lovely. The classes are just super, super fun. And I took Jamie to his first boxing class on Saturday and he absolutely loved it. Now he's like, can I come to every class apart from the early ones? Cause he's not an early riser, but um, I just love them. And I am going to like, I guess I build myself up to doing a spin class cause I've heard they're quite intense, but really fun as well. So I wanna get into more classes there and just mix up. And I feel like it makes my routine a bit more fun. And I love morning movement cause it's like the only time I don't go on my phone and I just have me time and I can just like, think about nothing. I think I'm quite an overthinker. Oh. That is my alarm to go and make coffee. Because <laughs> Badger wakes up at half six, so that gives me the chance to go downstairs um, once he's awake, because my dad is currently home um, from last night for just four days again. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I can't remember what I was saying, but 
morning movement and like it's the only time I switch off and like I'm off my phone and I'm such an overthinker so I'm constantly in my head and it's the one time I don't think like I just don't think of anything so yeah <laughs> I really enjoy it um but yeah I'm gonna go and make my coffee and start the day and head there I have packed my swim stuff however it completely depends what it's kind of like when I come out of the class but I feel like overcast still could mean that it's nice I just I don't know, there's no breeze, but there's just nothing. I love it. Anyway, I'm gonna go make coffee. Hey, good morning. Good morning. <laughs> good morning. Oh, little monkey. Look how cute you are. <laughs> I'm making a coffee. Do you see your reflection? <laughs> after that class but it was so fun and I was having my ginger shot getting a really good filled <laughs> school really good juice acai bowl which I'm excited about um so yeah cheers good morning happy Tuesday maybe I didn't film yesterday I can't really remember anyway happy Tuesday cheers to that <laughs> people watching me okay holy some days it's not as spicy, but today it's spicy. You know, the dog that's like, and then they go spicy. Whoa, that feels good though. went in the sea. I did try and record it but my um, camera's at home and my phone has like zero memory so it completely cut off. So I did a little time lapse here. Um, a lot colder today but so so nice. Um, there's like a few people in the sea so I felt comfortable going in alone. Sometimes I don't depending on like the wind and stuff like that but um, it was lovely. Really enjoyed it and I'm gonna eat my acai bowl and dry off a little bit before going home and starting work but it's literally only 8 30 which is so nice <laughs> um yeah i just love living here so much i just feel crazy grateful that i get to just walk down to the sea there's also like five guys just laying on their backs just meditating stunning <laughs> it's so nice they're just laying completely flat with their head under i wish i could do that my ears get so blocked um, yeah, anyway, I'm gonna enjoy sitting here for a bit and I'll catch up with you guys when I get home. Hi guys, I'm just eating dinner. I thought I'd say hi because me and Chloe did not pick up the camera. I was literally just catching up with her and yeah, we only had about two and a half hours together. So we had a really nice lunch and did some photos, which I'll leave on the screen here. And um, so that was really lovely. And I have currently just made a chicken veg stir fry, which I've eaten most of. I'm also multitasking with this one. I, you can hear his little tippy tapping. I honestly don't know what's got over him. He just has gone absolutely mad while I was cooking dinner, which was really difficult because I was boiling loads of stuff. And he was just weeing everywhere and he doesn't wee in the house. So I think he was trying to get my attention because he's probably wants to play a bit. Um, and he's been sleeping most of today. So I think he's got the zoomies now. But um, it's your walkies very, very soon. It's your second walkies very soon. <laughs> I think he knows it. It's his walkies again soon. But anyway, before I update you, I'm actually heading to the beach to catch up with some school girls this evening. So probably we won't take you guys along just because... I haven't seen them in ages, um, so that should be lovely. But I have got my bikini on underneath because I do want to go back in the sea, even though it's like grey and cloudy, it's still like 25 degrees 
and really really like humid like it's very very humid um oh my god now he's just uh, look at him guys do you mind oh <gasps> no no we play with this no <laughs> no <gasps> and you gotta distract him because he just keeps biting my feet no <laughs> look at him he's running wild oh dear him. oh be careful be careful please oh dear me Anyway, that is this evening's plan, so I may catch up with you guys later, but if not, I will see you in the morning. Good morning, guys. So it is now... Wednesday. It's very, very early. It's like half six. <laughs> but I am up and I am out and I'm heading to another class today. However, I probably shouldn't have booked a class today because my body is in a bit, like in bits. <laughs> I was going to say in a bit of pain, but um, my shoulders from yesterday are very, very tired. And I'm basically doing a... I love walking through this park in the morning. It's so nice. Um... It's basically a body pump class, so it's like all areas of the body. Um, so I'm hoping it's more legs than shoulders <laughs> and back, but um, we shall see. So I will let you guys know how it goes, basically. Um, I have packed my swim stuff. It's still like 23 today, but very, very cloudy again, which I'm grateful for because <laughs> I just burn. Um, but yeah, it should be good. I'm gonna let my coffee sink in, my banana, and then <laughs> be good to go. But um, I feel like the music and like sometimes just like doing it at my own pace is always a really good idea when I'm feeling like this. So I'll probably do like very, very light weights in this class. Um, but yeah, I'm excited and I'll speak to you guys after. <laughs> Hello my lovelies, it is a couple of hours later, I went for a little swim, you would have seen the waves, it was so so lovely, really warm this morning, like I found the sea quite warm, which was quite nice, um, and I got back and I have just been like having my breakfast and chilling and doing some admin, some send offs, done some like big job send offs and things and then I've just got ready, I've been doing this like new makeup look and I've been doing less foundation and I much prefer it like I've been doing less makeup on my eyebrows which I'm still trying to grow so that I don't have to have them as fluffy I'm still a little bit like umming and ahhing about it like I love them like this but sometimes I think they can be a bit much so I'm just trying to like find the balance of like how I want to style them but yeah I've just been using different products and I've been loving it and do you know what foundation I've gone back to I have literally gone back to sheer glow by NARS and I used that when I was in like year 11 year 12 it was like the first other foundation that i started using other than like dream matte mousse <laughs> so i've gravitated back to that because i feel like it's very glowy and it doesn't feel too heavy and it's very buildable so put that on my skin today and i'm using the charlotte tilbury like highlighter and then i've got the refi bronzer and blusher on and then nars orgasm eyeshadow palette on and lancome mascara and then lips i have the refi rosewood lip liner all over and that is it and then I just put a bit of gloss so yeah anyway today I'm filming so I have set up my little camera here I've got my other phone <laughs> my other work phone set up because this phone the memory is full and I am about to film a colourful summer city nasty girl video for them which is exciting I love working with them it's like probably one of my favourite brands to work with so very very exciting that I get to work with them again this set is actually from them I actually have it in two sizes <laughs> so I live in it like I live in it at home when I'm doing admin bits especially with this like beautiful weather and heat that we've got um but yes yeah, so I'm filming today so there's not a hell of a lot to show you other than probably like little bits here and there of me trying stuff on but um I just so I'll give you guys an update of like what's going on and what I'm doing today um, but yeah I'm gonna start filming that and yeah go down and start doing some styling I think I'm gonna try and film a denim short styling video as well very conscious that there's drilling going on so I'm gonna stop filming but I'll catch up with you guys soon <laughs> Good morning. 
morning guys it is now thursday i'm with janae morning morning really overexposed i'm filming on my phone again because my camera doesn't actually fit in my bag today i'm actually heading into london for a facial so i'm excited about that i've just like literally put on sun cream oil toner um and i'm feeling fresh faced and ready for the day ready for the facial um this facial has been booked in on and off for like nearly six months but every time we like go to do it something gets in the way on both ends so I'm really excited to go and try it out. It's a clinic in Soho. Anyway, we are at Wolf Fox at the moment. We have got the cold press immunity shot, ginger, turmeric, orange, lemon, black pepper. My worst nightmare. Let's in, do it. In a thing. Can you open mine, please? Yeah. I'm scared. Maybe I should film you doing it. Don't be scared. Then we're scared. Um, and then we got some danishes and we're getting a coffee. And we're just sitting, chilling before I have to get the train quite early this morning. Um, it's like 8 a.m. now. Um, I actually missed my swim in the sea today and I felt really sad about it that I missed it to be completely honest um Has it got orange I've in been it? loving it uh is it in orange juice oh no holy shit Jay <laughs> oh no cheers cheers Is it horrible? Yeah. Okay. Okay, second action. Go on, get it back. <laughs> Is that good for you? Oh. Ah. That, guys. You're crying. I'm, yeah, I'm tearing up. I teared up straight away. I don't like black pepper. That was the worst part. I actually feel a bit ill. You're upset. I'm really upset. I'm really upset. Get me. I had a like city cleanse I believe it's called so I literally feel like a new woman my skin feels like really really tight and I think I had one of their gentle pills done so she's recommended that I don't wear a lot of makeup for today for at least eight hours which I'm gonna struggle with because I'm going out tonight so I'm gonna have to see how I feel when I get home I feel like I'm just gonna have to put like a little bit of like something gentle on my skin um but <laughs> we shall see um and yeah it was lovely it was really lovely I had a massage um she did like an extraction so I get quite a block pour she also gave me um, well I bought this hyaluronic um mask overnight because my skin is just so dry it's just ridiculous and I have just gone and got a coffee I'm sitting on the train I may have done a little Sahara shop basically there was some stuff that I'd seen online and I was umming and ahhing about it and I thought you know what I'm gonna buy it and then try on when I get home so I'll do a try on probably tomorrow with you guys because when I get in I've got to like sort my hair get ready for tonight by like five because I'm then babysitting Badger for like three hours so yeah I'm gonna eat my lunch I'm gonna do some editing but it was a very very lovely facial very very much enjoyed and yeah very excited about these little outfits in here it's very colorful so I am back home. I have actually put on makeup, which I know I was told not to do after my facial, but I'm going out tonight and I just felt like I needed a little bit of something. So I have done my little glowy summer makeup routine. I've got the Refi lipstick on, bronzer, blusher, and then I've got sheer glow foundation, like I said, and then eyeshadow, the NARS orgasm palette and yeah pretty much the same makeup as yesterday and I am actually just going to quickly film a job that arrived earlier than I expected from Oasis so that is currently what I'm doing so I will show you guys tomorrow what I picked up in Zara um, and do a little try on then but how beautiful is this dress I'll show you in here quickly it's just stunning like the print and design of it is gorgeous it also comes in tall and petite I should have probably got the petite because I probably would have liked it a tiny bit shorter but I feel like petite is sometimes very hit and miss so I have just gone with the regular in this length and I'm five foot three for reference but I'm gonna start filming on my camera those clips for this little reel I'm doing I'm doing like a heat wave styling outfits here's a little sneak peek 
of some of the colours I have gone for and prints. Very, very excited about all of that. Um, so yeah, I will show you guys very, very soon, like different bits and bobs over on my Instagram if you fancy seeing some of these outfits and things like that. But I'm going to film this ad now and then I'm going to do some editing and admin and emails before this evening. I'm so excited. I was actually just choosing, bring you guys over here, such a mess. Honestly, this is such a mess, but this is my filming for the weekend outfit area. But I think I'm going to wear my little Zara skirt tonight and then potentially take this jacket I love the like how the greens kind of match but yeah and then I also look at these heels guys I'm obsessed I'm not gonna wear those tonight but I literally am obsessed with those and then got a little red top and a jean combo and some other outfits for tomorrow's filming I just like planned all of those so all the outfits are ready to go as you can see I'm loving orange and pink right now <laughs> Hello guys, happy, what day is it? Saturday. Saturday. Um, I think I spoke to you guys yesterday and um, I didn't actually show you the Zara outfit so I promise I will but me and Jay basically went and did some photos so I'll leave them on the screen here. Nightmare. And then, nightmare, no, Jay just honestly hates the sun. No, no, I don't hate the sun, I hate standing in the sun with all my clothes on. Bending down. Yeah, he was shooting. It was a sweaty boy. Oh, no. But we got some good snaps, so I will leave them on the screen. So thank you for helping me. I much You're appreciate welcome. it. You're welcome. <laughs> Today we went and did morning spin yeah. at Rocks. Jay had his first first spin experience. How was it? Say how it was. Yeah. Pump it. Pump it. Give it up. Give it up. It's going to be a bit windy, so I don't know if I can carry on filming. Anyway, it's Saturday, we have done our spin, we've had our juices, and we're now heading down for a quick dip. We can't stay down long because we had to take badges to the vet, so it it's worked. Midday. It's midday heat, and Jay basically just shrivels up. He I shrivels burn. up, he burns, he then moans for hours, and <laughs> it's just, it's not how I want to spend my day. So we're going to go in, and then we're going to leave. <laughs> and I'm going to go lay in my garden and do some work. Straight before in. Straight down, straight in, straight out. And that's straight why home. Straight home. Um, but we are heading to Cornwall tomorrow, so basically today is a work day for me, sadly. But we've got the week to enjoy the weather in Cornwall, so I'm oh, very look, excited. Um, oh, cool! I love it. Why this don't we is, do this that? is the rollerblading look. club. Anyway, I'll show look you guys up. when we get down there. Me. I am back home from the beach. I've just had a shower and got in some comfies and I have just started editing this video, which I feel like is a little bit all over the place, but yeah, I don't know. I feel like not a lot. I haven't really done a lot this week apart from like work, swim, gym, <laughs> that kind of thing. So I am going to do a Zara try on now. So let me get up. We have to take into consideration though, that I have just scrubbed my tan off. And whenever I scrub my tan off, any of you that are like regular tanners will know, or maybe you don't, but maybe you can relate to this. I feel so insecure in everything I do and I don't have fake tan on, which is so bad. And I'm trying to get out of that habit so much so that I'm actually not gonna fake tan for the next six days when I'm in Cornwall because it's just me and Jay and my family and I'm not like shooting or doing anything like that. And I'm able to kind of like take things slow and chill. So I am going to just embrace my natural skin. <laughs> um, but yeah, I need to get out of being so reliant on it because it. I don't know how to do my makeup without it. I don't know how to feel confident without it. It's, yeah, it's just one of those things. It's the only thing that I do that I don't know if I could ever stop doing. And I actually worked out recently, it was actually because at school people used to take the mick out of my natural skin. But that's not why I continue to do it now. But anyway, just taking into consideration that that I you don't feel incredibly confident trying this stuff on right now, but let's have a little look inside. So I've got one dress to try on with you all, which I actually did photograph um, with Jay. This dress I haven't even tried on yet, so it's gonna be like first try with you guys. And then I also got this little crop blazer to try on with you guys, 
but the blazer, I had a vision for it with some red suit pant trousers. So we're gonna have to see if they work in the way that I envisioned them. So we have those and we have another outfit, which I have actually packed in my suitcase. So for that outfit, I am gonna leave it on the screen here because I have packed it for Cornwall because I literally already have worn it three times. <laughs> I love this like peach shirt and this little skirt score. So it's got inbuilt shorts, which is amazing. I literally love anything like that. I just feel like it's so easy to put on and just really comfortable and you're not really worried about flashing your pants when the wind blows and things like that because in Brighton it's so windy so I feel like that's just inevitable. But I've just um, been packing. Just show you guys. So this is my little suitcase for Cornwall. Um, so I've gone for like the peachy shirt here and then I've got a little jumper, my Birkenstocks, stripe set, play suit and shorts and then... And here I have all my gym stuff, towel, bikinis, um, a few socks and pants, and then just like a few comfy t-shirts and stuff like that. So that is me packed up. And then I've just got my trainers and then my little top and shorts for the car tomorrow because it's going to be a hot one. And yeah, that is me pretty much packed. I've just got my little like facial bits here. In this little bag these are so handy whenever i do a aurelia order of my jewelry they come with these bags when you order from like the lux range and i use them for like when i'm traveling they're so so good um i also this evening my dad and sister's birthday is next week so we're having our little like dinner to celebrate their birthday because my dad's away i'm away my sister's away um so we're just celebrating this evening so i did just wrap their presents um over here um i did actually get them experiences i always feel like experiences are just presents that i like giving and presents that i feel like if i was to get something i'd want an experience with them so i got my sister a facial and then cine world tickets so she can actually go with whoever she wants i did like plus three people um and then I also got her some new makeup in there. And then for my dad, I got him his favourite chocolate and a massage and a dinner tonight. <laughs> so that is their little prezzies from me for the B days. But yeah, I love this wrapping paper. That's what I was going to show you. Um, I just thought that was really cute. I know it's not birthday wrapping paper, but I feel like it's July wrapping paper. So um, yeah, let's get try trying on because this video is ever going to be too long otherwise. But I'm going to end on trying stuff on because... I want to get this live tomorrow when I'm traveling to Cornwall. So I'm going to try stuff on now. Okay, first up, this dress. I've had to shut these because it's honestly a sauna with them open. But first up, this dress. I actually wasn't expecting it to be like as tight on me, but I do really love the kind of shape and fit of this. It's like a kind of stretchy material and you've got this little clear slit, like dress, slit, slip, <laughs> not slit, slip dress on underneath. Um, and yeah, it fits really nicely, I feel like. It's like very, very flattering on. Um, I like the fact that you've got this kind of detail here. I feel like it's like a very, very flattering shape because it kind of comes across your body, which is quite nice. And I do just love this print and design. Also, I'll leave on the screen here, um, I styled it with my little lilac blazer out for like a little date lunch the other day, which was really lovely. But yeah, I like this one. It's comfy, it's cool, it's cute, it's got some colour, and I'm all for the colour. Okay, this does need a tan. Like, I need to have a tan for this dress, but I think this is so cute for, like, on holiday in Greece with, like, or well, anywhere. I always say Greece because it's always somewhere where I want to be. <laughs> but um, on holiday with little, like, wraparound, like, wedges or platform heels as well. I think platform orange hills I would potentially wear this with or some platform like pink hills but I yeah I don't I would not wear this anytime soon it's not giving the dress justice with the fact that I'm literally in pretty much my pajamas before filming this but I just think it's very cute very fun could be nice as like a wedding guest outfit as well I feel like for like if you've got any summer weddings I couldn't really work out if these bits were armholes do you get what I mean <laughs> Is this an armhole? Am I? There's just a lot of fabric under the arms here. And I thought, oh, maybe that's like this. But no, I think it's just to make it float out a little bit more like that. But um, yeah, I love the print. I love the design. I think it's super fun. And yeah, for summer, I'm definitely gonna be wearing this. Even with like fake leather jackets with trainers, like going to the pub and stuff, I feel like it's a really, really cute little dress for that as well. 
Okay, this is the little blazer. I'm obsessed. I will definitely be wearing this a lot. So this is definitely staying. I love this little like kind of tidy toe. You can tie it at the back, tie it completely under. I also love the sleeves as well. It's like this really beautiful kind of satin material. And then these trousers I got from Naked, which is why they still got the label on because I'm trying them on for the first time. But five foot three problems. <laughs> they are so long, like so long on me. Like that's my foot on its tiptoe. So platform heels or I've got to get them taken in, unfortunately. And I also don't know if these colors are just too like dark in terms of like the red and the pink. I just had this vision for it being a little bit more like, I don't know, them blending a bit more. Maybe this needs to be a bit more of a lighter pink, but I don't know, maybe it would work. Maybe it'd be quite fun. I've got my um, birthday in New York in September which is very, very exciting. Um, and I just thought maybe rooftop drinks with some pink hills might be quite cute um, as like a bright colored outfit, but I'm not entirely sure. I'm gonna have to see if I can get these taken in because I love these anyway, as they are. I feel like with little um, black camis and white cami tops would be very, very cute with the trousers. But yeah, little blazer wise, I love it. It's very cute. I definitely need to like tie that up properly because I haven't double knotted it like that. But um, yeah, I love the shape of this. I think it is a very, very cute little blazer that would be easily dressed like up slash down, I guess down from it being like as dressy with these to being like still evening wear with like a pair of your favorite blue jeans and then little heels that are pink perhaps or neutral and styling with more of these neutral accessories at the same time. But it's very, very cute. Anyway, back into comfies, back into my little editing spot. I don't actually usually edit on my bed, but it's just comfy today and it's cool in my room when the blinds are shut and the windows are open. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are good and you're having a lovely July. And yeah, if you guys wanna see a Cornwall vlog, let me know. I wasn't, like I've got other Cornwall vlogs where I actually like bring you guys along and do all the kind of bits and bobs that I love down there. But when I go now, it's more like, just like how I normally go and like see family and stay with them and do like my favorite beaches and things like that because we're only there for three days so it's very much just like family time and things like that which I'm happy to vlog I just didn't know if anyone would fancy that kind of thing because it's not particularly like exciting or like showing you guys Cornwall in that way but I have previous vlogs for that so I will leave them linked down below if you fancy seeing that kind of thing but let me know in the comments and yeah I just hope you guys are good and you're having a lovely lovely month and yeah I will see you guys in the next video I've enjoyed doing a little week with you and catching up with you guys and yeah I will speak to you guys soon lots of love Mwah. bye